Hey, what's up everybody? It's Jake here at Picote Solutions. So, it's late in the day here. I'm at the Worldwide Training Center in Anderson, South Carolina. And I was kind of reflecting on our day today. We had a great day uh, training with uh, two different companies. And uh, one of these companies that we were training, um, I'll be perfectly honest, they were a little... They've been Picote users for a while, and they were a little frustrated. And, you know, we quickly realized what some of their frustrations were, um, and we pinpointed a few things and techniques that they had been doing uh, wrong. And so th th this is not uncommon for us. We see people that come in, and they've never been trained on, on our equipment before, and one of the main things that they had struggled with was reinstatements. And usually uh, when we go through this equipment, um, and I'll show you our table, kind of the progression of how we do our training. We, we have all of our tools laid out here in our training center, and we start with the cleaning chains. And I, I got thinking, I thought, you know, these guys, their, their biggest problem is that they're unable to do reinstatements well because they're not prepping their branch lines. And so th this, this table full of cleaning tools here uh, is a key step in preparation so that we can utilize these tools over here. If you don't prep your branch lines and you don't clean them out, the chance of you having success with a tool like one of these here uh, is pretty slim. And so in order to be able to have a successful reinstatement, you have to prepare the branch line. We spend a lot of time prepping the line uh, that's going to be, uh, the, the pipe that's going to be lined I've got an example of that sitting over here. So this is a, a, a setup that we use for reinstatements where we go through and we, we ran a liner all the way through here. But chances of you having success if this were a cast iron line, you go through and you clean this branch line or this main trunk line and you put a liner in it, but you've never done any cleaning on your side laterals. When you go to pull those toilets or go through a kitchen sink line to do a reinstatement, if you've got all kinds of scale and debris stuck in those lines, your cutter is going to come down from the back side. It's going to knock all of that scale off and pile up behind the liner. So your chance of success for a reinstatement is pretty slim because you're fighting with all of that scale and debris that's inside that pipe. So it got me thinking, once we told the guys that, they said that is, that is the piece that we've been missing. Nobody told us that we needed to prepare our branch lines. And so I thought, you know what, why not make a video and just point that out? So the, the lesson here is that when you're, when you're preparing a pipe for a liner, you need to also prepare your branch lines. It has to be part of the planning stage. Otherwise, you're going to end up with a, a miserable time trying to reinstate later. And so I just wanted to point that out and make a quick video that if you want success with the reinstatement tools, you've got to utilize these cleaning chains. You may have to pull a toilet. You may have to go through a trap, a fixture, whatever the case may be. If you don't prepare that branch line, you're never going to have good success doing a reinstatement. It's a critical part of the process. So we make all kinds of tools for the cleaning and descaling of those branch lines so that you can have success later when you do your reinstatement. So just thought I would point that out. I hope everybody's having a great night. Um, I'm the lone wolf left here at the training center, and I just got thinking, so I thought I would make a movie, um, a little video quick to, uh, to point out that. So if you guys ever want more information uh, on what we do here at our training center, uh, feel free to come by. We've got a fully outfitted uh, training center with uh, a full roughed-in bungalow. As you can see, we've got the vertical stacks here. This is our, our coating bungalow. We've got uh, roughed in piping in here with, uh, with traps. Don't judge us on all the strapping. But uh, we've got this all roughed in and ready. So if anybody ever wants to come in for some training, we can do vertical stacks. We can do toilet, toilet lines. There's a shower, shower pan right up top there. We do custom training for uh, all of our epoxy coating and reinstatement. So anyway, hope you guys have a great evening. We'll talk to you soon.